There's nervous. been a lot of smack talk around here between Ryan and Gelman regarding whose significant other's Great healthy Gelman. banana bread is best. We've decided to put an end to this madness, this two days of madness, <laughs> and have them battle in a banana bread bake-off. <laughs> Today's contender is a personal chef, a graduate of the Art Institute Culinary School, and in my opinion, the greatest cook in town. Mm. Proud and excited to have her here. Please welcome Shayna Taylor. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. Okay. Oh my God. So. Shana, don't be nervous. I'll be nervous for you. Okay. Don't be nervous. We're gonna nervous. get this. We're gonna get this. Okay. okay. Now, why is this recipe so healthy? What it's do you not put in it? It is guilt-free. So, it's gluten-free and sugarless option. You can put agave or a maple syrup if you want. <laughs> <laughs> you guys look this good. Is this is the story good. of his life. <laughs> okay. Here, yeah, you want the thing? Keep talking, babe. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it's glu it's gluten free. It's flourless. The only really thing that um, anyone could consider to be guilty is the almond butter. But personally, it's just protein to me. And, and you make your own almond butter, don't uh, you? Yes, yes. Almond milk, almond, almond butter. butter, and you yes. use the pulp, and you and you we make, make crackers almond crackers out yeah. of the pulp. Yeah. When I, I say we, I believe in wheat. homemade everything. I think yeah. that it's like homemade everything is kind of my my jam, since you don't really know what all ingredients are. Right. What, so, what's yeah. in thing? All right, so how do we begin? What should we, what All should right, we do? All right, so, Kelly, can you start mashing? So you want to take yes. the spoon. Mm -hmm. Scoop it out. Yep, into the plate. So yep, I got it. That. Yep. And yep. these bananas are how old, Shana? When did we buy those? <laughs> those are just baked for 40 minutes low till they're black. So oh, so you can you can make them blacken. Yeah, if you have ripe bananas, that works too, because, you know, everyone likes the sweetness of the ripeness. Okay. okay so, babe. Yeah. Pumpkin I'm puree. Babe. Put okay. it in here. How much? The whole thing? The whole thing. Which is uh, half a cup of pumpkin puree. Yep, it's nice. Let's do the almond butter, which is <clears> one <throat> cup, freshly ground or store-bought. Okay. Yeah. Very good. Good, good, good. Get it all. <laughs> Clearly, I've never done this at the house, right? Yeah. Um, Shana, does Ryan, know where the does Ryan know where the kitchen is? He does, he does. He, does? he likes okay. to chop anything. He's like, can I do the onion? Thank can you. I do garlic? Thank you. I know he likes to chop. chop. He likes to okay. chop. Okay, crack the eggs in there. You're crack a master the cracker. I know you are. Should I put the banana in? Oh, the, the, the whole thing? Yep, the whole thing. Okay. That's good. <laughs> Should I put that in? Yeah, you put, can, that yeah in there. You can put that in That's there. That's the mashed banana. Uh -huh. Banana. Okay, good. Now we get that. Good job, babe. Yeah, good yeah. job, okay. Cal. So now we need pumpkin pie. Pumpkin pie spice. spice. Yes. This is pumpkin pie spice. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now, Gelman thought it was a little spiced when he tasted it when you made it for Kelly the other day, so. Well, he's got a very delicate palate. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> you can. If you want to, you can also make your own at home instead of buying um, already bought or store made. It is from cinnamon, nutmeg, and ginger. Oh, you're yeah, very comfortable on national television. I know you look I'm really like, good. Very, very I'm like poised. shaking. I'm like, oh, no, you're doing a you great look job. so you're good. Okay. When I look That's at you, it's like looking in a mirror. <laughs> it is. <laughs> In my mind, in my mind, in my mind. So that's a little bit of um, Celtic salt for just a little savory. Mm. Ah, yes. And then alcohol-free vanilla extract, also Ooh. organic. Good. Yes. I didn't know they okay. made it alcohol-free. And free. a half a teaspoon baking soda. Great. Mm. Yeah. All right, now we mix this up? We do. Okay. Do you want to do the honors? I do. Right. Oh my gosh, this is exciting. Or just Moment don't fling of it. truth. Fli babe, I'll low, start it low, in low, 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 low. <laughs> yeah, put it in. There you go. I got it. Good job, right, Ryan. So oh my God. Thank you. I'm going to get the right consistency. It smells fantastic. Oh, it it does smells smell like the holidays. It does. Now, are those, Shayna, are those chocolate chips? Yes, they're unsweetened dark chocolate chips. So oh, that, so they're like healthy chocolate chips. Yes, it's an option. You don't have to put it in, but if you like a little chocolate, since there's not a lot of sugar in it, it kind of breaks it up and gives you a good, mm. yeah. How would you say I this think, is? I think that's, I think you got it. Yep, right. yep, oh, oh, yeah, it, don't, oh. yeah, don't take it out too soon. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm just saying. I won't saying. take it out too soon. Okay, Kelly. Tough crowd, yes. these two. Dark chocolate chips. Right in? Yeah. Oh and fold them in, fold right? Fold them in, We're yes. Watch there this. Go. I'm going to fold them in. See that, Ryan? Right? Yeah, I do. I love the way you fold, fold them in. They're like that. And, nice. <laughs> and make them spread fold nice and spread in. out. Okay. Yep. Good. Then we put it into the... Banana bread. Banana dish. Now, do we have to oil the banana bread pan? If, or? If, this one you probably would because it's glass, but if it's non, normally nonstick, works perfect. But there's natural oils in the banana bread from the almond butter that'll oh. actually keep it from, from sticking. No kidding. Yeah. And how long have you been a baker, Shayna Taylor? I'm actually not a baker. <laughs> <laughs> but don't tell anyone. Yeah. Don't I just tell really, them. I really, really love 
you know, banana bread and bananas. So it was the one thing I kind of taught myself how to bake. And since I'm an organic, healthy chef, it, you know, yeah. You baked that banana this bread last, last week and did. um, it, it didn't make it past the afternoon. Like we, I ate I'm it happy. and then everybody else ate it. People just Except for Gelman. He didn't yeah. like it. Well, he yeah. just, he's being true to his wife. Okay. Now, what, but the thing that she says to me is, I say it's guilt free, it's fat free, it's sugar free. She says, yeah, but you're not supposed to eat the whole thing. <laughs> But yeah, so but we did read we the do. whole thing, so. That's okay. Okay, okay. We'll all right, on, so last topping. topping is a crumble of banana chips, walnuts, and pecans mm. with a little bit of vanilla extract and coconut oil. Do you just food process it? Yep. Or, yeah, great. And then oh. you just, Ooh. That's Ooh, gorgeous. Nice, for a little crunch on the top. Oh. Yep. So then we put this in the oven. Pop it in the oven. Okay, it's in the oven. Oh, look at and that. Then, oh, How magic. <laughs> How long is, how long? And at what temperature is it in the oven? So it's 350 for about 30 to 45 minutes, depending on how thick it is. Okay, Perfect. we taste it when we come back right after Yay. this. Stay with us. Nice Yay. job. Okay, let's try it. Oh my God, amazing. It's oh, delicious no and it makes you tall. Mm -hmm. All right, the recipe, mm. Shana's recipe, you can check it out on our website. Also, Shana has an Instagram account called My Bikini oh. Kitchen, where it's all recipes. And tomorrow, Lori Gelman is going to step up to the challenge, and mm -hmm. we shall see what mm -hmm. we shall see. Mm -hmm. This oh, is delicious. Thank you, thank you. Mm -hmm.